Oh boy, I am so nervous right now. You have no idea how much anxiety is spewing through my veins right now. Why? Well, because there's something really important that I, I need to tell you. No, it's, it's nothing bad. You don't need to worry about that. In fact, it's, uh, it's something really, really good for me. I, I've been, uh, holding this in for a long, long time now. It's actually approaching two years since I first found out. But it needs to be said, and I think that there's no time like the present to tell you. You know how we've been best friends for a long time now, right? We've always done everything together. I mean, people would often say that we're basically attached at the hip. And I hope that that can still be the case even after I tell you this, but uh. Okay. <sighs> I'm coming out to you. I'm coming out. I... I am non-binary. Oh, you, you wanna know what that means? Okay. Um... Alright, so... You know when, uh... When a mommy and a daddy make a baby, you know? Uh... It can be a guy baby, or it can be a girl baby. You're familiar with the term transgender, right? <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm not, I'm not a trans guy. I was born a female, but I don't believe I fit into the category of male or female. You understand where I'm coming from, right? I mean, most people have interests that don't align with their gender. Like, some guys like to wear dresses or makeup. Some girls like to play football, <laughs> you know, things like that. But this is so, so much more than this. Because I like both of those things. I like makeup and I like dresses, but I also like getting my hands dirty, molding sculptures and playing football, but whenever the teacher says to separate into groups of boys and girls, I always get this really weird feeling inside, like a strong desire to be like, hey, what about me? I've been feeling this way occasionally for a bit, but I didn't really notice it until two years ago when it started to become more prominent. I mean, I'm fine with any pronouns. I really don't mind what pronouns people use for me. It's just, when people call me a girl, it just feels so weird. And I've even confided in another friend about this, and they called me a boy. And I'm like, well, that doesn't feel quite right either. But if it doesn't feel quite right to be labeled as a guy, and doesn't feel quite right to be labeled as a girl, then where does that end up leaving me? Well, it only leaves me with one option, really. That I am, in fact, neither. And then I'm like, is there a third option? So 
so I looked it up online and I found out that non-binary was an actual term. And so, after doing a bit more research, I realized that I think that fits me. But, there is no typical way to look or act non-binary. I've seen lots of non-binary individuals who wear dresses, and I've seen lots who dress in ties clothes. But I've also seen many who do a mix of the two. Like they're trying to look androgynous, but I don't know what I want to. This is kind of stressful. I mean, I just don't really care about what I wear or what pronouns people use for me or anything like that. I just feel like I just want to be me. I don't mind the pronouns, the clothes, the anything. I just don't really like being labeled a girl, but I don't like being labeled a guy either. Do you uh, understand what I'm saying? Ah. Well, I mean, it is a bit hard to understand, but basically what this means and I'll put this in simple terms. You can still call me she. You can call me he if you want. You can call me they if you want. I don't mind. But instead of calling me a girl, could you just call me a person? <laughs> sure, you can call me dude. I don't really mind. But just don't call me a girl and... Don't call me a boy, either. It's really hard to explain to someone, but thank you. I'm glad that you were willing to listen. It's not easy to come out to people, especially since you always have the risk that they won't accept you. But I'm really glad that you accept me. You make me feel like I'm actually human. <laughs> I, I tried to come out to, to Robbie earlier today, and he had the exact opposite reaction. He knew exactly what it was, and he said that, he said that it not only didn't exist, which is, okay, that's your opinion, but... Then he kept yelling, girl, 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 in my face. That is really rude. So, uh, I told him to stop, and he didn't, so... I walked away from him, and I don't intend on being friends with him again. But, again, thank you. It really means a lot to me that you were so accepting of this. It's not easy to get this stuff off of your chest. Well, thank you.